Hey you, it's me, Curtis P. Hello everyone and welcome to another Sims 4 room building video. Today's request comes from the user named that YouTuber, Debra. Yeah, that's right, Debra. What's up, Debra? Well, they ask, she asks, I don't really know if it's a he or she. Anyway, can you make a fancy bathroom? Yeah, you know what, Debra? I can make a fancy bathroom. I can make so many bathrooms. Why am I talking like this? Nobody knows. All right, let's jump into this fancy bathroom. Fancy, fancy, fancy. All right, great. That was weird and awkward. So a fancy bathroom, what are we thinking? I'm thinking like hardcore, crazy, fancy. So we're gonna have, there's gonna be like an area here, then there's gonna be like a four piece, then there's gonna be like this, kind of like that. So this is where our, in, like our, whatever it's gonna be, <laughs> it's gonna be, yep, yeah, good, the English. Um, I want, I want a piece that sort of sticks out here, actually. This is where the, oh no, but the tub, I should put in the big tub. Where's the big tub? I gotta place down some objects first. So, um, this is where, like, the sink and stuff is gonna be. The tub, obviously we need to have a huge tub. Um, do we have a, what if we have, could we have, could we have a hot tub in the fancy bathroom? Is that a possibility? Do we, do we put that? I don't think you get actually clean with this, do you? Hygiene level three, hygiene level, yeah, no, you don't. Anyway, um, so let's put in this, this big tub needs to go somewhere. I'm actually gonna leave it like that because it looks, looks really cool. But I think there's gonna be like a corner that you go around and then that's where the tub is gonna be. The tub's gonna be over here. It's gonna be a really weird shape, but it's gonna be fine. We're gonna love it. You are gonna love this, it's gonna be amazing. Okay, so we're gonna put this in like this. And that's where the toilet's gonna be. I feel like the toilet needs its own little area. So you can't really see it when you are over here. So you're gonna walk in, here's the main entrance area, probably gonna have like a lounge area over there because you wanna lounge a little bit. What else do we want? So we want, hmm, do I want, I think I have an idea. I'm gonna put the tub in this corner like this, and then we'll put a shower here. So there'll be kind of like a, actually let's get rid of, oops, get rid of that. Get rid of that, get out of here. So there'll be a shower that goes here, and the tub goes there. And then back in here, we're gonna put that wall like that. There's gonna be, this is where the toilet's gonna be. And unfortunately I can't put in, obviously I can't put in doors and stuff which is always the issue. So I'm just gonna put in kind of like that. That's a really weird room and I don't think it recognizes it as a room yet. No, it doesn't because it is so crazy and broken up. So I just gotta go and trace over it here and around like this and here and back here. Blip, 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 blip. There we go. Now I think it recognizes it as, it does not, it still does not want to recognize it as a room. Ugh, game, why do you do this? It does this all the time and it's so annoying. Can you, can you recognize this is a room though? Okay, yeah, see it's, it's a room though, right? Like it's definitely a room. I hate when the game does this. Thank you, you've recognized this as a room. Congratulations, oops, I didn't want that there. Congratulations, okay, great. So now that we have a room, thanks to the game for figuring that out with its life, um, what do I want here? I want, actually, I think I'm gonna put that like, oh my goodness, what just happened? That was weird. Okay, this is a very buggy room, guys, so here we go, building things and stuff, okay. Now what I actually want is I want this to go in here, but because I couldn't do that last time because it broke, there we go. So we're gonna have the toilet around the corner here and then that's good enough. So we're still good. If I move this, it doesn't like fall apart. Obviously this piece falls out, but that's fine. Okay, good. The ultimate sign, if something is a room, is try moving it. That's always my, my go-to. All right, so I'm gonna go like really classic on this because I think it's the way that we gotta go and you gotta go classic. I want like wrought iron entrance because that's pretty cool to have in a bathroom. Windows, 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 all dim windows. Yep, that's my song. 
and I'm sticking to it. Um, are there smaller ones that are like that or no? Because I don't really want to match multiple different kinds. Uh, it doesn't look like it. We can go with this. These ones are kind of a classic, and then we'll go with the larger, something like that. There we go, something like that. And then in this corner area, actually there's small ones that are like this. Yes, perfect. So we're gonna put these in like that. So when you're in the tub, you're kind of in this little corner nookish area. And over on this side, I do want some windows as well. And I think I'm gonna put in some that look like that. There we go. So lots of windows and lots of space for the Sims. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of this wall and I'm gonna put in a half wall here just because I think it'll look better to have. And we can put in like a, I don't want a really tall half wall. I just want like a semi, yeah, that's kind of the right, it's kind of the right height. And then I'm also gonna put it in like this. So you kind of get, this is like a separate area. Does that look weird? I don't really know yet. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of that and put in like a full wall right here. Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, so let's put in a actual shower in this corner area. This will be where the shower goes, like that. A shower. Actually, let's get rid of the. These are too tall. I don't like how tall those are. Too tall. Chose the wrong height. Hmm. I could always go with like a really small little short one. Kind of, kind of looks cool. I like that. The idea that it's very short. And then see, I could put in like a really tall one there too, just to sort of separate the areas out, you know, make it a little bit different, make it a little weird. I don't know. I'm just like making this the most elaborate bathroom that I possibly can. All right. Surfaces. Surfaces. The surfaces. The surfaces of life. The surfaces of life. I don't know what I'm doing. All right, let's put in, ooh, we can make them red. I don't really like those ones though. We're gonna go with these. Ooh, black, those are kind of cool. Oh, why is that only three? I wanted that to be four. Jam, damn. damn man. I think it's because I put this in the wrong spot actually. If I just do this. And then we put in a wall here. That will fix it, there we go. I was like, I thought this was supposed to be four. What? What did I do? All right, decorations. I want mirrors. I want all of the mirrors. All of the mirrors. Uh, there's no like, there's no like floor to ceiling mirror, which is really annoying inside of this game. So we just get that, which is pretty close actually. Floor to ceiling. And um, let's find some plumbing here. Uh, not a toilet. I do not want to put a toilet in there. That would be really weird. Uh, let's find some sort of really decadent sort of pieces here. These do come in a white, which is nice. There we go. Put that like that. Uh, G to get rid of the grid. Let's put in some paneling here, because paneling is pretty cool. Um, that's not what I want. I think it looks too much like... Does this come in white? It does come in white. That's actually kind of pretty much what I want. And we're going to use blue, because blue is like a cool accent color. What does the black look like? Yeah, I like the way the black sort of works. And... Alright, so we're going to retexture these to be white and blue, just like that. Perfect. I feel like I should have this as white, but then a part of me is like, no, leave it. Can I make this like, this does come in like a dark, like a black. I don't mind that. What if I do this in like a black too? Actually, it's not a black, it's like a dark wood. And then what we do here, I'm gonna change this back to being I have no idea if this is gonna look good or not. I'm just like, I'm really testing this out. We're gonna get the columns out. Everyone excited. We have columns. If you, everyone, like all the time in the comments section, they're always like, Curtis, can you do a room without adding columns? And I always respond, no, it's not physically possible. 
stop asking. I'm kidding. It's probably possible. I don't think so. I'm addicted to columns. I'm addicted to columns. I think I want to use these columns instead, though. I think they look better. They're kind of more of what I'm going for. You know, if you know what I'm like, trying to go for here, it's kind of like a, you know, like more of a classic, modern sort of take on things. I don't know what I'm talking about. All right, lighting. Lighting is important in order for your room to come together. Come together right now. All of me. All right, so let's put in some of those. Some damn dare fancy lights. Got that there fancy. Y'all so fancy. Okay, let's put in these, which kind of match, but don't really match. Uh, yeah, I guess those are the closest that we can get. And then over here, we're going to put in one. Actually, we're going to put in one here, here, and one here, and then I'm just going to get rid of the other one on the other side. Hand tool, delete. Goodbye. All right, grid, turn off. Let's get some flooring in here. I'm thinking, I'm thinking some tile. I'm thinking tile, you know? It just, it seems like the right thing to put in here. Ooh, I kind of like that. I just, it looks so modern though. I feel like this needs to change. This has to be white. I feel like it looks really weird because it's so dark and it needs to be a light color. And then I'm gonna change this all back to being white. Because it just looks strange that it's a totally different color than the rest of the room. So we're gonna put this all as white and blue and we're gonna call it a day. Perfect. Let's um, get some trim on here. Let's make this like a white trim. There we go, like that. That's nice, that is nice. White and blue. Uh, what's, what it has is fine. There we go. Like that. And um, I do want to use these kind of here and here. Unfortunately, I don't think there's like a white version of this, is there? Not really. Well, kind of actually. These ones look a lot better in this situation. I'm like going around, I'm always retexturing everything too. I always have that like need to like place objects and I'm like, but that color doesn't look right. And then I have to change it like 60 times. All right, let's make sure there's actually a toilet in here. Because that's kind of an important thing that I feel like I might forget, which is weird, but I probably would. Because I'm that kind of a guy. All right, so let's put in a piece of art. You know, because you're fancy and you have art in your gigantic bathroom. Your gigantic bathroom to say the word gigantic as if it's some sort of weirdly huge word there we go and let's put in doo -doo -doo -doo. obviously we need the toilet roll the toilet roll is crucial it's a crucial part let's put in a rug as well um i feel like i could probably use this rug actually Current color, actually, I don't mind the shading on that one. And I feel like I'm gonna use the same, ooh, I think this rug gets bigger. Yes, there's a four rug, nice. We're gonna put that right there in front of this, and we're gonna use the same sort of, what did I use on the other side? Is it like that one? Yeah, it's the same one. Perfect, all right, so then we're gonna put in, over here we need some comfort, we need some seating, you know, some luxurious seating. We'll use this one, because this one's very fancy, very fancy. Um, I want something that's like white. I guess white and blue works. Surfaces, and we want to put in some small little pieces on either side here. Nope, not that. I feel like these might be too big actually. So let's just put in some plants because I think the uh, other things are gonna be too large. Yeah, it's too big. Even when I scale it up, it is too large. Whoops, I just hit the start button for a uh, mistake. Let's see, we'll use this. This is kind of cool. And we'll put one on each side, and then we can re-skin it to be like a black 
there we go. There we go, that's kind of nice. But you know, you can come in, you can relax, it's the bathroom, you know, it doesn't have to be like this weird place in your house. Except it probably should be, because it's a bathroom, but whatever. It's fine, don't worry. Don't worry, I'll be happy. Ba -da -ba -da. Yep, words and things. Um, let's put in these weird little circles, but actually let's not, because they, they just don't match, they're too modern. They are too modern for that spot. I need another painting to go in there, just because it looks weird without it. It's kind of been set up to have a painting in it like that, and we're going to move it down a little tiny bit. I'm also going to put in some sort of table across from here. Um, surfaces, tables, and something like this is actually pretty nice and we'll make it in white perfect and then let's find some plants to put on there some decorations you know you want some sort of plant and maybe some books why not you need some sort of reading material you yeah, know reading material uh, while we're adding clutter based items i might as well add a bunch of this we'll add a kleenex box we'll add a thing of soap whatever those are and what else do we have? The soap keeper. That's an interesting thing. Uh, we can add some candles, some scented candles. Everybody loves candles. Oh, except it's like right in front of, there we go. And, oh, we should put in some towels. We can put towels over here. Towels over there. There's also um, actually storage. Do we have, actually wait, no. Go back to decorations. Miscellaneous. There are... Is this the one I want? It's kind of what I want, but not really. It's like this, but that just looks ugly, so I don't think it's that one. Isn't that like a fancy towel carrier? Maybe not. I don't really see one. The fanciest one is this one, so... We'll go with this, and I'm gonna have to change it because it's gold. It's gotta be white. Gotta be white. It's gotta be the same color, otherwise it's gonna look weird. Um, we can put in these guys here. One and two. Change these to kind of like a, a little bit of a white. Uh, what else do we need? I could put some sort of art here on the wall while we still have time. Let's see here. This piece of art? No. Could put in like a giant. That's just too big, though. No, those don't really go in a bathroom, though. Huh, we could put in like these pears and stuff. And the apples. They make an appearance in so many of my, like, house building videos. There we go. Yeah, that's kind of nice. I like that. I like that. Um, what else do we need? We could put in some uh, of these. Uh, where are we here? These are what I kind of want. Actually, what about these? These are kind of nice to go over top of these pieces. Like that. Up one more? Thank you. And then there are smaller pieces that we can throw to sort of throw over top. There and there. And there, and there. And then I'm going to change the color on these to... Yeah, something like that. That's kind of nice. It's like a royal kind of a... It's kind of like a gold. I don't know what color this is. It's more like a beige than anything else, but... It sort of matches some of the other items. A little bit. Is that the right color that I chose? Yes, it is. Perfect! And then this I want in like a white. There we go. Nice. That's awesome. Perfect. So there we go. We have ourselves a very fancy bathroom for your Sims to enjoy. So they can come on in. This is like a whole room and experience in itself inside of your Sims home. Here's a final shot of the room here, everyone. Don't forget you can add this into your game if you want. There's a link on screen right now. Or of course, there's one in the description down below, just like always. 
check them out, add this into your game. It's free for you, so please do so. Don't forget, I also released a brand new Sims 4 house building video this past weekend, so check it out. Once again, link on screen right now, or of course, in the description down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did and you want to stay up to date on all of the latest Sims 4 building videos that I create, because I'm creating a bunch of them, click on the subscribe button right now, join the Simming Club right here on my channel, and of course, be informed of all of the latest build videos when they are uploaded. It's an awesome way for you to stay up to date so just click it, it's super free, super awesome, and yes, great things. You can also follow me on many social media websites, there are annotations on screen right now, or of course in the description down below. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and of course, until next time, I'm Curtis Parody, and happy simming!